And what do we have now? Well, you know, we enjoy hearing the Christmas carols. And uh, like you said, there's just a very short season that we hear them. Uh, but we do uh, enjoy them. And we also appreciate people coming up to us and letting us know they're watching our program. We appreciate um, the Christmas cards that we have received and we've received quite a few of them from our viewers and a lot of them have asked how I'm doing and uh, I want to let you know that uh, for those of you who may not know I, I have been diagnosed with Parkinson's and we appreciate the prayers and the concerns of our viewers and uh, thank you so much for your prayers we do appreciate it and right now we have pretty little 20 year old Manuela her, she lives in Loma Linda, California. We caught up with her at a, at a group home in Portland, Oregon, where she was working during the summer to get money for college and so forth. And boy, she is a singer. I tell you, I never heard a more clear voice on a woman in my life than Manuela is. That's right. And she gets so high, she can practically break a crystal glass. <laughs> so she's going to play a little guitar for her while she does this song. Now, this song was written for a guitar. They had no piano organ. That's what the song was written for a guitar. And it's an old, old traditional song that's yes. simply entitled Silent Night. So enjoy. <laughs> Didn't I tell you, man, while I was going to do a great job, clear as a bell. She loves singing for the Lord and loves the Lord. So yes, I don't know where she is right today, but we do trust and pray that uh, she's serving the Lord still out there in TV land, and, and uh, we'd like to have her back someday. Yes, we would. And, you know, folks, what would a Christmas program be without Silent Night? We just had to have that one. I do want to make mention of one more person that uh, we saw out and about, and uh, Billy was standing in line at the bank. And uh, this gentleman turned around and saw him and said, can I have your autograph? I watch your program. Everybody in the bank in that line was looking like good grief. Who is this guy talking about? I had my strolling down memory lane coat on, I guess. Where he's, I don't know. Maybe he remembered my face. I don't know. I got only a face a mother could love, somebody <laughs> told me. But Billy was so taken back by somebody wanting his autograph that he forgot to ask the gentleman's name. <laughs> so anyway, though, he knows who he is, and we trust that he's enjoying this program so far.